Okay, so we want to install the Finch materials to get our robot working. Let's go to finchrobot.com. There's a lot of material on this website, so you can explore as you wish. You can buy robots, you can have a look at the news and what's happening around the world. It's a lot of teaching material as well and for different grades, so check that out. We want learning and specifically software for the moment, because we want to install the materials. And if you scroll down, you'll find grade 10 plus. We're looking for the Java things. So if we click on the Java link, we should be redirected specifically to classes that have to do with Java. Now we're using BlueJ specifically. So if we look at the download section, there's a BlueJ link downloading it for Windows. If you have Mac, of course, you download the Mac or Linux likewise. There's also a tutorial on this page uh, that you can use to have a look at how to install it. It's just under 10 meg, so it shouldn't take that long for you to download it. It downloads as a zip file, so you don't actually have to install anything, but you do have to unzip the material. So let's go ahead now and just unzip it. And in this folder now are all the examples that we can play around with just to get us acquainted with what the Finch can do. There are classes or programming pieces of code that exist that just give you uh, an idea. If you click on source files, all these folders, they include the code so we can play with. But if you scroll down, there's a package file which if you have BlueJ installed, which you should have, if not go and have a look at the video on how to install Java and BlueJ, then it should open up all these code examples for you. So the first thing that we need to do is just compile this because it's not compiled. And then we can select whatever class we want to play with. For example, if we go into simple output, we can see you can choose dance or hello world. If we just click on dance, that should open up the Java code and we can have a look at it. Now don't worry if you don't know exactly what all these do, you will in due time, but it's just interesting to know that this will be executed when your Finch robot runs. Uh, you can explore all the other things as well, just to have a look at what tests you can do. If we just go for the dance, then we click the void main and click OK. And what that does, it should connect to the Finch. Now you should have the Finch robot connected, and if you do, then little dance will happen.